Hello everyone and welcome to my deeper dive into damage control playing as Ricardo or Ricardo. Um, in this level we'll have to do three objectives. Um, collect the prisoner tags, three of them. Secure the armory and collect the visitor registry data. First of all we're gonna start off with a little bit of a run. You can do that still at the beginning. Um, or at least in my runs I could have just I could just run at the beginning. Here you will first will find your first prisoner tag try to lure the alien over here by running a bit because this is probably the hardest part of this run so far um, and will be as well because this is a very narrow corridor and there's a vent right here where he can drop from which will pretty much slow down your run substantially now he was very nice to me and he decided to drop into another area which was very favorable for us so we can head into this area right here where we will need to lock off this armory here now first of all you need to grab this security access tuner, hack the code. Now I did it very quickly because the alien was nowhere near me. Um, this might be different for you, but in my case I thought let's just do it, let's go for it right off the bat. Boom. Security armory done. Now of course we'll need to move through um, this area again because we need to go to the second prison attack and collecting the visitor registry data. Now of course again um, this can be different for you. The alien might be walking around here, so be careful. <laughs> if you go through this vent or directly on the right, you will find the other key card or the prisoner tag, my bad. Um, and then you can just head back in because we need to move through the hallway, which is on our right right here. Straight on. Now be careful here because of course this is a long hallway and on the left here there is a room. So grab your motion tracker here. I didn't hear him anywhere because I heard him, I thought, I think going up into the vents and moving to the right side. Um, and then you should be able to just walk through this part. Um, but be careful because he will mostly trigger here and drop into this hallway. Like so. What you want to do is not grab the first uh, little uh, alcove, you want to grab this one, the second one. Because if you grab the first one, he will see you immediately when he um, comes out of the door, as you can see. So be careful, um, that one is way safer and you have a little bit of mo um, space to move around. Now this room is very tricky, be careful here, do not get spotted by the camera. Um, you can avoid it by going under the table as you can see and then um, yeah, just passing underneath it. As quick as you can, you don't want to be stuck in this room. It will pretty much end your run because the alien will be here forever. Keep on walking, this door here on the left, you want to go in to grab the last prisoner tag. You want to move on as far as you can before the alien comes, because he will come. Now I made it all the way to here, which is pretty much a perfect run up to now. Um, so we'll have to just wait until he passes by. There is a vent in this hallway here, just outside the door. So we'll just have to wait for him to check um, the, the room at the end of this hallway. And then he can go up into the vents and then we can move on because him walking around in this hallway is pretty much a no-go because we can we don't have anything against him now i must say if you grab a flamethrower for this for this mission it'll be a breeze because you can just flame him every time you see him and do it even faster but you will lose the multiplier of using a flamer so that is your choice um we can just walk in here there is nothing wrong here grab this key card and then we will move on to secure our last secondary objective which is collecting the visitor registry data now he has the tendency to then drop into this hallway after this um, so really be mindful um, about his presence as you might see i can see him moving back to the hallway which is a bit of a problem there you go so i decided to stay here because i can either go left or go right now, as you can see he tried to cut me off which he didn't of course work because i saw him moving and now i pretty much have a free um or a straight shot to this area now this almost went wrong because i was really moving quick this this match um so i grabbed this and i heard him behind me which if i grab my motion tracker you can see um but i was lucky that he didn't spot me and there we go we have all three secondary objectives completed now for the last part you just want to take your time because these hallways are literally 
so small and without any cover that you will need to have a an open um, an open road to uh, the final area which will be behind the room that the alien is now in so even behind that now i saw him here he's listening he's waiting so i waited for the door to close in order to go to grab my motion detector so he wouldn't get any faint signals of my motion tracker i don't know exactly the range that he picks up the sound of the motion tracker but you know just just in case now he decided to be kind of an uh of a bad person here to me because he uh yeah he just went up and down the same damn hallway over and over and over and over again which is the risk that you take when um, you go in here now he will never go as far as i know he will never go into this room um, he will just patrol the hallway over and over again now as you can see this is the perfect moment he went to the right which means that he will most likely enter this room on the right which means that we can follow him this way and get out of that room that we were stuck in so that we can move around more freely again now, as you can see he entered the hallway at the far back of this room which is ideal for us because now we can slowly move towards that area now he is now moving to the elevator so i decided to throw a flare here that if he comes back because it's a it's kind of a curved um, hallway here on the left if he comes back, he will see the flare through the um, window, as you can see, and he will go and investigate it, which is perfect. Because now we have a free, or just a straight shot for the exit. Now, of course, the exit is not just free for us to take. We have to do one more thing in order to do this. We will have to do the scan over there. Be sure to stay on a bit of to the right side because the boxes in the middle of the room will block the view of the alien should he enter the room so immediately go to the right now of course this was kind of a tense moment because i heard him walking in the hallway but we made it and i thank you for watching and i wish you much luck with this mission and goodbye